Hey everyone, welcome back to Pajama Crafts, where I do crafts in my pajamas. If you're new here, my name is Sarah. Welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. And if you have been with me for a while, thank you so much for coming back to hang out with me. I'm super excited for today's DIY. I have this mirror here that Koi's mom actually gave me when she was getting rid of a bunch of stuff in her house and asked me if I could use it and I said yes and I actually actually gave me another one too that hopefully I will eventually DIY as well but I was really excited to use this in a space in our bathroom um, that just had an open wall and then I can maybe do my makeup or get ready there or whatever um, but yeah so I was really excited it's much bigger than it looks in the video but you will see um, how it looks in the space at the end. So I just want to paint the frame on this so I'm just using some painters tape to go all the way around the edge. I wish it was as quick and easy as it looks in the video but it took me like 59 years to tape this thing. It was such a pain. If you're a really good like precise painter that does not make a mess I would suggest just not even, you know, just skipping this step altogether because you can scrape the paint off of the mirror if you need to. Like, I didn't get perfectly in the corners with my tape, so I was able to just scrape it off a little bit at the end. Um, but I would definitely suggest the tape if you're kind of messy like me. Um, but once I got it all the way around the edges, I'm just using some Waverly white chalk paint. That's what I had on hand. I kind of wish I had like some milk paint or something like that for a little bit different, um, you know, like a softer texture. I don't know. Um, but maybe I will add a sealant later and that might make it a little better, especially for cleaning and stuff anyway. I'll probably do that later, but I didn't do it in this video. All I did was two coats of the white chalk paint and then I went in with some sandpaper and just to stress those little details. I love the way it came out. It looks so shabby chic, so pretty. Could go with farmhouse, boho, shabby chic, whatever your style is. This one's going to fit pretty well because it's neutral and just a little bit of distressing. I absolutely love how it turned out. I'm just going to play some music and let you guys watch. Bree did help me <laughs> with this a little bit, so I'll leave those clips in as well because it's really cute and funny. Um, but other than that, that's pretty much all I did. I hope you guys enjoy this video and the transformation of this mirror. Thank you again to Koi's mom for giving me this mirror that I could redo. It fits in the space perfectly. I absolutely love it. I did not have the best lighting in the bathroom when I did the the like little overview at the end so I apologize for that but you can still see how it turned out in the space and I absolutely love it. Do you guys love my Christmas jammies? I have these <laughs> penguins that are snow skiing and I got these from Goodwill a long time ago. They're so comfy and I love them. I'm curious to know what you all did for Christmas, so let me know down in the comments. Did to know what you all did? Did you have a small gathering with your friends and family or anyone? Um, what did you guys do? We ended up doing a small gathering with just Zach's mom and then also my parents later. Those are people that we see on a regular basis anyway. Bree goes to my mom's in-home daycare once a week, so those are kind of our people that we see all the time. And so we just did a little gathering with them. Let me know down in the comments what you guys did. I am curious to know. Also, I have a question, another question for you guys. Um, as you can see, I have my headphones on here in the video. And I'm just listening to some country music this time because Brie was napping. So that's why I had to wear my headphones. But I was listening to some Luke Combs. I'm really loving him right now. I'm curious to know what you guys listen to or watch crafting or if you just do the craft in complete silence and enjoy the peace, what do you guys do when you're crafting? Do you listen? Do you watch? Or just enjoy the silence? Let me know that also in the comments. I'm curious to know. Also, if you guys know of any good podcasts that you really like right now, I like to listen to things like that as well as music and just kind of anything inspirational or anything like that, let me know what your favorites are.
I always forget to mention too that I do have a new channel I started called The Other Side of Sarah where you guys can go watch um, more of like lifestyle mommy type content. So I'll leave that channel linked in the description. And then also don't forget that I do have all of my social media linked below as well, including a Facebook group where you guys can share all of your creations. I love to see what you guys are making. So don't forget to check those out and join my groups if you haven't yet. And now, I promise, I'm done talking. Let the peaceful music commence and watch me paint. What are you doing? I need to get some more. What? I need to get some more. Oh, you had to get some more paint? Yeah, I had to get some more paint. Oh, I see. <laughs> Good job. I, I, I like to get some. Getting some more paint? I get some more paint. We just came down from upstairs. Haven't even done her hair yet. I'm making her breakfast. <laughs> She's working on the project. That's such a good job, Buggy. 
What's how it looks with two colors. Painting. You're painting. I, I want to see. I want to see. You want to see how you look? Okay. Can you see yourself? Okay. You're a baby. You're not a baby. You're a big girl. <laughs> You're a little performer, aren't you? <laughs> I want some more. You're so silly. Some more paint. You're getting some more paint. Yeah, I get some more. Good job. Old McDonald had a farm. Okay, we'll listen to it. I guess the McDonald had a farm. <laughs> Alexa, play Old McDonald had a farm. Old oh, McDonald had a farm. Good job. I see yourself. You can see yourself. Yeah, I see you so. You see yourself? Yeah, I see you so. Yeah, you look so pretty. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's a tripod behind you. Painting some more? Yeah, painting some more. Such a good job, Buggy. We're ready to take the tape off. Painting the tape off. Watch out, Watch out. Okay. Watch out. Where are you trying to go? Watch out. Okay, Buggy. Watch out, Bobby. Watch out. Hang on. Well, that was anticlimactic. Okay. It's a nice clean line. This is the cheap side. Yeah. Bobby, here we go. Here we go. Bobby, here we go. Oh, thank you, Buggy. Whoop. Okay. Put it all in a nice little pile on the floor. More paint? I can work it. Good job, Buggy. I got pretty good. Careful. Don't, okay. don't get on there, okay? Bobby, is, is it so heavy? Feels heavy? Yeah, it feels heavy. Oh. So like I said, I did end up having to scrape off a little bit of paint in the corner. I wouldn't really recommend it for like the whole <laughs> entire thing. It wasn't like really hard, but it wasn't super easy. So I would definitely suggest the tape if you're worried that you're going to get some on the mirror. Um, but other than that, I think this turned out really, really awesome. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more DIYs like these. I hope to see you in the next video. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!